Hi, my name is Kendall, and today we're going to talk about building your dream photography website in 10 minutes. I meet so many photographers through my coaching programs, mentorships, and Instagram community who tell me that they don't already have a website. They think it's a huge undertaking or something that they're gonna have to hire a web designer to do, and I want to show them how simple and easy it is to create your dream photography website using Pixie Set. So some of the things that I love about Pixie Set and how they have their website hosting are, number one, it's super intuitive and user-friendly, especially for a first-time website builder. You don't have to hire a web designer or spend hours learning how to create this website for yourself. Pixie Set automatically configures your website to a mobile version, which is a game changer in my opinion. I would struggle so much with my my previous websites, making sure that they worked on mobile version because that's where a lot of my clients do use the platform and Pixie Set just has it nailed down perfectly. It's also geared towards photographers, so it's aesthetically pleasing, the templates are stunning, and it's very photo focused, which is really helpful because that's what we wanna show as photographers is our work upfront. Pixie Set also has gallery hosting as well as client management platforms, which is just amazing to have that all bundled into one website. Now I'd love to show you how to create your dream website on Pixie Set in less than 10 minutes. Let's start by signing up for Pixie Set. So we can go to my Instagram bio, click on the links, head to the recommended gear, and this will take you to my kit. From here, the Pixie Set discount code is listed right here. You can click on it and it'll open this page right here. With my discount code, you can start on a free account with three gigabytes plus receive 250 megabytes of bonus storage. So sign up right there. I already have mine signed in because I just signed up via my link and received a free account. So you can see on the billing process here, this is a free account. That's the plan I have right now. I have a free website, limited pages, posts, photos, and blog posts and the studio manager is free for up to this amount of details. I can upgrade if I'd like to, or I can start on the free account and see if I need to upgrade, but I'm sure the free account is gonna be enough for us to create a website in 10 minutes. So we're gonna go over to Pixie Set, and what I would recommend you do first is upload some of your favorite photos. So I uploaded some photos here that are gonna be from some of my favorite sessions. I have 180 photos within the free amount of storage that they give you. And then I added some branding photos of myself so I can make sure to showcase me on the website as well. So I have my two galleries that I already uploaded there through the client gallery. And now we're gonna start with the website. All right, start your timers. How long is this gonna take us? Let's see, one o'clock exactly. Let's go. Editing our website first, maybe the hardest for some, is to pick a layout to start with. So we have lots of different layouts here. Beautiful. I already don't know which one to choose. This is gonna be a tough one, guys. I think I'm going to go with, I like the Sierra one. Let's, we can view a demo or we can apply the theme. I'm gonna apply the theme for time's sake, but you can always demo your own. We're gonna start with this theme right here. Beautiful easy already. It's showcasing me how to create different things, edit stuff. I'm going to skip it all because I've already done this before and I want to make it faster for you, but you can go through all the step-by-step -step process to learn how to do it. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to change this main photo, make sure it looks like me. So I'm going to go to my client gallery, click on photos and pick a photo that I took that I want to showcase as my main photo. So let's upload that one there. Beautiful. I wanna take this away and I don't really want a title in the middle because I like photography that showcases the entire photo as the starting page. Then something that I think is important is to create that contact form. So let's get back to this main page right here that shows all of our different menu sites. So contact is something that I wanna make sure is on there, easy, up to date. I love how they already have content in here for you to use easy. I'm just going to change the photo to make sure that it's showcasing something that is my work when they see it. So let's choose this one. Love it. Oh, and the words already work. I can keep it as this if I want to. Here we can edit our contact form to make sure that it's everything we need. It's already going to email it to my email address, which is amazing because that's exactly where I wanna see all my contacts or my contact forms come in through, all my inquiries come in through. I'm gonna go back to the homepage, make sure everything's gonna lead back to that contact form. 
this is gonna be something about me. My name is not Laura, so I'm gonna say, perfect. Um, I don't do fashion, so I'm gonna easily delete that. And I am just gonna say your, Destination wedding photographer. Perfect. Um, this doesn't sound like me. So I'm just going to switch this up and say something simple. And then um, I want this to go to my contact form because I want them to contact me. So I'm going to select the page head to contact and that's going to take them straight to my contact form because that's what's the most important to me. If they want to read more about me and see my about me page, they can click on the about me link on the menu. But personally, this is what I would want to do for my clients. Also got to add a photo of myself here so that my clients know what I look like and it's not someone else. Five minutes and we already have the main page almost built out. Beautiful. Here, we're gonna add some photos to showcase my work. So let's do this one, this one, haven't done this one, this one, and this one. One more far away one, perfect. Now people can see some of my work, scroll through some of the things that I do, see more of my work, I can change that page or I can just delete it and they can find that somewhere else. This is gonna be another contact page push. So I love what it says. Get in touch. We got to make sure that that button goes straight to the contact form and upload another photo of something that would make them want to contact me, but also is a wide image. Let's do some. Mm, I like this one. Let's do this photo. If it doesn't work, we can always trade it out. I like it. So far, this is looking amazing and I am super happy with it. I'm gonna change this photo to something different. That's mine. And let's do this one. I'm gonna delete the other ones just for the sake of making sure everything is my work on this page other than the Instagram bio. Testimonial, I am going to quickly grab one. from Google. Let's do this one. Perfect. And I'm gonna say views. Cause I like that word better right now. Um, perfect. Uh, I'm not a huge Christian Dior fan, so let's say perfect. More me. And then all this looks great so far. So I have I have a home page. I have a home page and I have a contact form. Reading what this says. Let's change this quick. Um, perfect. Easy. And we have a contact form in less than 10 minutes. That's all I wanted. From here, I can delete these pages or hide them so that until I have them ready to go, I don't need to have them on my website if I publish this. Perfect. And we preview it. I can then double check that everything works. All the links are working. We can see what it looks like on tablet version, mobile version. Beautiful. So easy. <gasps> that was so easy. So you see how I, I made it so everything goes back to the contact form. Just head to the contact form. Then we can chat more. Contact me, contact me, contact me. 
And that is what your photography website should be doing. It should showcase your work, your beautiful work, some reviews of your things, as well as a little bit about you and direct them to your contact form so you can book more clients. That's all I'm gonna show you guys for now, but I am sending you all the best luck in creating your dream photography website. And I just showed you how simple and easy it is to do, how much fun you can have with it, making it your own, but you can get the simple, like straightforward, what you need to get done so that you have a website running. So you have a place to send your clients so you can earn more money so fast and so easy. I hope this was helpful and I can't wait to share more tips. Have a great day.